Uh, hello, today's topic is uh, uh, DEXA scan. Uh, DEXA scan is a special type of X-ray that measures bone mineral density, also known as BMD. You know. So DEXA stands uh, for dual energy X-ray absorb, uh, absorptiometry. So this type of scan um, may also called as uh, DX scan or bone density scan or uh, bore denso, uh, densitometry scan as well. So, so DEXA scans are often used to, to diagnose uh, uh, or assess the, someone's risk of osteoporosis, a condition uh, that weakens the bones and makes them more likely to break. Uh, as well as uh, being quick and painless, a DEXA scan is more effective than normal X-rays in identifying low bone mineral density. Uh, you may need to have the DEXA scan if uh, you are over 50 years of age with the risk of developing osteoporosis uh, or under 50 years uh, with other risk factors uh, such as smoking or previous fractures. You know. And the WHO has uh, created a 10-year fracture risk assessment tool uh, which applies to both men and women between 40 and 90 years of age. And the tool can be used to assess if the DEXA scan is appropriate and calculates the, your risk uh, of fractures in the next 10 years. You know. uh, the osteoporosis can affect people of both sexes and all ages. So although older postmenopausal women are particularly at risk, you know. So uh, this is because uh, after the menopause, the level of uh, uh, estrogen declines, uh, resulting in a decrease in the bone mineral density. Uh, uh, the more dense your bones, uh, the stronger and the less likely uh, are to break. And osteoporosis doesn't cause any symptoms until the bone is broken. So uh, it uh, used to be difficult to measure bone density and uh, identify those at risk of uh, developing osteoporosis until a fracture occurred. Uh, however, it uh, it's now possible to measure bone density before someone uh, gets a fracture. You know. Now, during the DEXA scan, X-rays are passed through your body, so some radiation is absorbed by the bone and uh, soft tissues, and some travels through the body. Uh, you now, the special detectors in the DEXA scan measure how much radiation passes through your bones, and uh, this information is sent to a computer. Uh, so your bone density measurement will be compared with the bone density of a young healthy adult uh, or an adult of your own age, gender and uh, ethnicity. You know. uh, now the DEXA scans uh, uh, use a much lower level of radiation than the standard X-ray uh, examinations, so which means that uh, the radiographer uh, can stay in the scanning room uh, with you during the scan. So it's comparatively safe. Uh, the amount of radiation used during the DEXA scan varies depending on the area of the body uh, being examined, uh, but uh, is very low and less than two days exposure to natural background radiation. Uh, by comparison, a chest X-ray uses the equivalent of about three days exposure to uh, NBR, which means the normal background radiation, you know. And uh, a flight to North America is equivalent to approximately a week's exposure to B uh, and BR. So you can imagine how safe it is, you know. So uh, despite being a very safe procedure, DEXA scans and X-rays uh, are not recommended for pregnant women, as X-rays can damage uh, an unborn child. Uh, uh, thank you very much. Uh, and please, uh, if you need more information on the me medical uh, diseases and conditions, uh, visit our website www.diseasesandtreatment.com. Thank you. Goodbye.